And the other name of the day is Mohamed Salah. The reason for that is because in Football Insider last night, they said something we should address. I'm not going to deny anything as I don't know every single thing going on within every single club in the world. But let me tell you, man, Mohamed Salah was renewed by Liverpool last summer. So there's no point in next year try to... Uh, uh, blow a lot of rumors out there saying Mohamed Salah wants to leave Liverpool just because it was in a great season for the Red Devils. And uh, yeah, my opinion is that, man, we shouldn't try to attach a single specific player to Real Madrid just because they had a bad season. My opinion is if this guy really uh, renewed his contract with Liverpool, there's no point for him in leaving the next year unless something catastrophic or, or chaotic or or a kind of an attainable situation going on uh, in linking him to Real Madrid. There's no point, right? And on, on the other hand, I don't think Real Madrid will try to sign Mohamed Salah. My opinion is, I mean, from my understanding, Real Madrid is interested in some a bunch of other players in the forward, but not specifically Mohamed Salah, right? This guy is aging. This guy is a great player, though. No, I mean, don't get me wrong at this point, but I still think uh, his, he has to be or he can still be a very, very important decisive player for Liverpool, right? But we shouldn't be fooled by all these rumors popping up uh, linking him to Real Madrid. There's no point because I don't think Real Madrid is really, really interested in Mohamed Salah. I think that we are going to keep an eye on other different players like Vlaovic or Richarlison, but not Mohamed Salah specifically.